Hi, this is a little tutorial on how to install Visual Studio Code uh, together with the two Leo Script plugins for faster creating and developing uh, online courses with Leo Script Markdown. So the first thing that you need to do, if you're on Linux, you probably probably don't uh, need to do this, but I'm now running this on a Windows machine. So the first thing I have to do is to install Git. Downloading Git is simply a a version management system that is used to for a couple of things also in conjunction with a VS Code. So go to downloads. And this can be this is also used afterwards to publish your courses probably on GitHub on GitLab. So I download this for my Windows version. I simply click onto download. Uh, download for Windows. Click here if you want to download this. Yes. Since I've already downloaded this, it's already within my download folder, so I can skip this part and simply go to install this manually. Simply go to the uh, double click on the setup file. So it's not in the official Microsoft Marketplace, uh, but we are going to install it anyways. So hit yes. And the only thing uh, you need to know is just go with the default settings. Just hit Next, 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 install. So that's it. No, we don't uh, want to view the release notes. Just finish. We are going back to Cosia. So we now want to search for ES code download. Uh, there it is. It will point us to the uh, download website. It is Microsoft Editor. Simply go to my case Windows. Otherwise, you have to install it for your Mac or Linux machine. Click on the download uh, and it will uh, start to download the setup file. You can skip this part too since I've downloaded it already. So double click on this. Uh, we accept all of those agreements and simply go with the default settings. Install. So yes, we want to launch this. So it opens up the last folder I was in before uninstalling it. But what we now have to do is go to this extensions part uh, to the marketplace and simply search for the script. So there will be the preview. You click on this. You'll get some information uh, on how to use it. Simply click on install. And in the same way, uh, click onto this Lea script snippets. So simply and uh, hit the install button. That's a few some bit of information if you want to install this uh, for VS Code. So just try to, before reloading, uh, Control Shift P to get to the fuzzy search. Control Shift P, and then type in settings. So open settings JSON. This is the one we want to. And now to enable this, simply copy this uh, part. Copy. And we will paste it in here. So that's it. Hit Control S to save it. Now we can simply close it. Probably we need to reload this again. Visual Studio Code, there it is. 
and so this is not needed anymore but how to start probably with the snippets you have installed in something like if you type Leah you get a help so uh, the comments are better visual uh, can be seen on Linux but you can start your code or your course if you type in something like Leah in it hit enter and it will provide you with a some kind of stub uh, for your course that you can just use as a, a starting point control s to save it and uh, what you can remember is always to use control shift p to get to this fuzzy search again but this time you simply type leah script there are four options uh, you can preview your course in live mode uh, on the website you can test uh, this is one you can test it on the leah script web page and uh, preview it on the dev uh, with a dev server or preview it with a live mode so in this case it's also presenting us with a shortcut like alt plus l so we simply try this i hit alt l so it starts the development server so we close this and also so let me rearrange this So with the website so whenever you change probably the title to my new Leah script course and store it or save it with control s the preview will be reloaded and updated if you have not opened uh, the file the markdown file and you hit alt alt l You'll get to the default uh, folder view so we can still use it with test or go to the test file or go to the readme file and so and there is a way if you want to use it for navigation also you can do something like uh, if you want to get to the to this part to the styling part and don't click uh, here within or search it simply control i hit control and use a simple mouse click I don't know why it takes some time uh, but the first loading but afterwards you can do something like control uh, and click to get them to the point or to get to the slide in this case I will simply use control click to navigate between uh, different slides well that's it uh, how you can install uh, VS Code together with the two Leah script plugins